What's up everybody? What the fuck is up? Welcome back to Cooking with Bird Martinez, the one, the only bird motherfucking Martinez, bitch. What the fuck is up everybody? How's everybody doing? First of all, I want to, you know, talk about somebody. So a girl, a beautiful lady named Rene Serrato, hopefully I said it right, sent me a picture of her little daughter, Sofia. I was like, oh my God, this is the cutest little thing. She has little glasses. She's sitting there with her iPad, watching little old me. I want to say hi to you, Sophia. What's up, girl? You're so cute. Thank you for watching me. I was like, what? She likes me like a little girl. I know I might be a little bit too much, you know, I'm like, Ugh. but thank you so much for watching little old me. So anyways, motherfuckers, today we are going to do a little something, something. I've been wanting to make this video. Pero I was like lagging it because you know life. But anyway, so I went to the supermarket. If you hear that little noise right there, it's because I'm making some rice on the side. I'm making some white rice with butter. See, it's making more noise now. So anyways, I went to the market and I was all excited. I'm gonna buy my I'm gonna buy my mojarras, AK fishes, and motherfuckers, guess how many they had? I wanted 10. They only had two, four, five. Yes, five. But it's okay, it's all right, because Mandy wanted me to make her some chicken wings anyways. So I'm gonna put those on the side. And then Sofia, la tortilla, my daughter, last night, right? She's going through my Instagram. And I always catch her going through my Instagram, but she likes to look at throwback pictures, like the fun times we had. So, uh, but this time she was like looking at the food. And she's like, mommy, there's something that I want you to make me, but I don't know what it's called. And she's looking and she's looking and she's looking and she found it. So she wanted me to make her the steak with the spinach on the side and the little butter that melts, you know, but the butter I put um, parsley on it or whatever. But I'm not, I don't have no parsley today, so I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to put some spinach on the butter so she could think it's green. Hopefully she doesn't watch this video. But anyway, so I went and I just got a steak. It was like $3. It's not like the fancy ones, but I'm trying to make three foods. I know, but my kids are going back to school on Monday, and it's going to be sad. I know people are there just want to get rid of their kids, but they're like my best friends. I want my best friends with me all the time. You know what I'm saying? In fucking five, ten years, they're not going to be with me like they always are with me. They're going to be like having their boyfriend or going to college or going to work, and then it's not going to be the same. I'm going to be over here crying on my little self. No, I don't know. I've been thinking of having another child, but I don't know because I get a little cray cray when I have kids. You know what I'm saying? And you guys are going to be like, who's that? Like, who's my personality changes a little bit. <clears throat> but I feel like that was when I was younger. So maybe as an older, more mature woman that I'm going to be. Maybe. Because I've only been pregnant under 30. So I don't know. I don't really, really know. Anyway, let's get into it. So I bought five mojarras. Let's see what they're called. Clean. Tilapia. They're tilapia? Mojarras are tilapias? Really? I don't know about that. We're gonna use some flour, all purpose motherfucking flour. My homeboy, Pillsbury. Like I got my tia Masola. I was laughing the other day. Somebody on Instagram, um, I took a picture of Sofia. She was like this. And somebody said, oh, and her tia Masola. I was dying, bitch. And we're gonna use some um, onion. We're gonna use some granulated garlic, some garlic powder, some oil, and to season it, we're just gonna use some salt and pepper. And yeah, let's do it. There's the rice that I'm making. I know that's all butter. I know, I know, but you know what? It's unsalted butter, so we're not gonna die of a heart attack, so we're good. <laughs> Maybe we'll die of a heart attack. Beach. Since we are gonna be cooking with chicken and fucking fish and what else steak we need this today in our lives comment i'm gonna wash the sink like every single time because bitch we don't want you know we don't want to die we don't want to cross contamination or whatever look at me when i want to be big words so i i do sprinkle a little bit get some water clean it like so the guy from the cucaracha was laughing at me because i went to buy some lettuce and I was on cold. It's 57 degrees right now. That's freezing here in California. We're not used to stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? 
So he's like, why are you wearing your sweater here instead of on yourself? And I was like, because I don't want to mess up my hair. You know, I don't want to mess up my hair. So and I didn't tell him. I'm, I'm like, I was going to be like, oh, I'm going to make a video. I don't want to be like, uh, I don't think I'm making a video. So yeah, I don't want to mess up my hair because I was going to make a video. But I wasn't going to tell him that. I just said I was boozy like that. I'm like, yeah, I just like to look good all the time. Just kidding. So yeah. Skinny now. Okay, so we have Mandy. And she's going to help us. I already taught her how to clean it. The fishes. Because there's a process. They say they're clean, but they're not clean according to my mama. And I listen to my mama. It's that we're going to take these motherfuckers out. Right here. What are they called? Gales. The gales. And according to Mandy, she says... According to what? Science, we used to be fish. And then we turn into monkeys, and then we turn into these beautiful beasts, motherfuckers. <laughs> okay, so let's do this, Mandy. Which one do you want to clean? This one? You could do it in the other sink. Yeah, I love it. Love the sink. It's so nasty. So, what my mom told me, we can open this first with the knife, Mandy. See. Si. Oh, we do this first? Yeah, we do that first. We can spread out. Spread them butt cheeks. And then we open this and we take these out. That's what my mama told me. And it makes sense because these are kind of slimy. And I don't think we should cook them. Yeah. Mandy's like, what the fuck is this? She hates slimy stuff. So her helping me is a big step for her. But I'm telling you, like, I tell her, you have to learn these things. See? All the way in there. Because you never know. A killer might tell you, if you don't clean the fish, I'm going to kill you. <laughs> Isn't that what you should see? It's kind of hard, pero pobrecitos. But you know what? Tenemos que comerlos. You know, this is this is where we come from. We eat fish. Except when you're pregnant, you're not supposed to eat fish. Why? Something about something of the fish. They have some shit in them that we're not supposed to eat. I don't know what it is. But aren't they healthy? They're healthy, but they have some. Oh, no, we're not supposed to eat tuna. I don't know. I'll go we could eat fish, but not, not tuna. I'll Google it right now. Okay. And I don't know. Wash it. What do I do here? Oh, no, you're good. Oh. You cleaned it. That's fine. We clean this part. We also pulled this one, too. Oh, I see it. Damn, you really opened it. <laughs> yeah, you're good. And then, after you wash it, you clean it like this, you open the mouth, you get everything. We're going to do what my mama said. We're going to cut three times, like so, like so, L, 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 I'm giving my <laughs> life for Bert Martinez. She's gonna cook me, and I'm gonna be delicious. <laughs> We're talking about a little subject, and I want to know what you guys think. So there's two theories, right? The evolution theory. See? And God. And God. The evolution, it means, like, there was a world, the earth, and then there was water. And then from water, where there's water, there's life. So there were little fishies, and little plants, and da 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 and we... Ow. Y te picaste el culo. ¿Qué te pasó? No, <laughs> don't touch that. That's going to hurt you. <laughs> and then from that, we became humans until we are now. Or there's the other theory which God created us all. But Mandy says that's impossible. It doesn't make sense. But si, but how did, who made water? I think God made evolution happen. He just, he didn't just pop it up. But pero where did God come from? The universe? Maybe another planet? I don't know. So that makes us alien? Mm -hmm. Oh, este arroz ya se coció, motherfuckers. Mm -mm -mm. It looks delicioso. I put a bunch of black pepper on the top. Porque, porque you know what? I'm about to lie, bruh. So I washed my mojarritas. Ya están limpias. But now, I'm just gonna add a little vinegar. So they won't smell, you know what I'm saying? I mean, I, I know they're fish and they're supposed to smell fish. I like a little bit like fish, but I don't like a lot of Whatever. So I'm gonna leave them there for five minutes with the vinegar, then I'm gonna wash them out again, then I'm gonna season them motherfuckers. Luego, ¿qué voy a hacer? I'm gonna wash them again. Just to be good. You know what I'm saying? 
So we have our fishies here. I'm gonna put some salt to season them. And now we're gonna put the garlic. This is the good part. <laughs> ¿Qué te están picando el culo? ¿Qué tienes? I told them to cut the chicken. The... I think I put a little bit too much. No, nah, it's enough. Ooh, since they're wet, it just stuck all over. But I've ate them like this before. This is my father-in-law's recipe. They look, they're bomb skis skis. So, you know, it looks a little funny. But it's okay. I still need to season the other side for the salt. I want to get confused like this. Oh, oh, oh. Ay, güey, me está picando, güey, me está picando. ¿Qué, Mandy? Pásale. Con permiso. I'm seasoning the other side. A little bit of salt. Y así. Should I put black pepper? Mm, yeah. Ooh, nice little black pepper. Let's see? So they were cutting the chicken legs for me to make the chicken wings. <laughs> they were having, it, it was like brain surgery for your asses. Mamona. <laughs> but at least you guys get to learn. I put my flower up in this hole. Now, they're always fighting for the seat. Like, it's a couch, and they're always fighting for a certain spot. So crazy. I'm just gonna... One side, to the other side. It's not that deep, guys. It's just a seat. Mm -hmm. Now we're gonna use my tia Masola porque con Masola no está sola, bitch. Um, I'm also gonna use my cast iron skillet porque I want them to get cooked from the inside and sometimes, why do I look so short? Sometimes when the, the pan is too thin, they get cooked from the outside, but they do not get cooked from the inside. You know what I mean? It's just science, bitch. It's just math. And I'm letting it get hot. I think it's almost ready. It takes like two minutes to get really, really hot. Sofia wanted to show you guys her outfit by what she was walking. Se partió la madre. <laughs> but it's okay, Sofia. You look cute. And it's that's all that matters. You know what I'm saying? Love you too. Let's see how this goes. Let's see how this goes. Up in this piece. Just be careful. Uh, it's okay with the thing. We'll just move it around. Well, the fish, they cook pretty fast because it's fish. See how when the skin turns white, it takes like five minutes on each side. I know it looks a little burnt, but like I said, I like my food a little bit burnt. I don't know why. Somebody said that's how black people are. And I feel like Mexicans and black people have a lot of common. Say what the fuck you want to say. I'll say what I want to say. That's my motherfucking opinion. Babe. I got to tell you guys a cheese, man. Which I wish you guys could smell this. Let me see a little bit. Just to verify. See how you hot. Taste it. Here's motherfuckers. Mm. Just the way I like it. I'm just gonna get my lettuce and I just go like this. You don't even have to cut it. You just rip that hoe. Like so. You're not a hoe. I'm sorry for calling you a hoe. I was just kidding. I'm just trying to be funny. You know I love you. It's the and some tomatoes. It's not even like a salad, it's just like a side side salad, is that what they call it? It's for like I don't know, every time I eat mojarras, because I was a little kid, my mom would always put tomatoes, and lettuce, and some limon. I wonder if I should use two buckets. The more the merrier, bitch. Let me go tell Mandy to get me a lemon from my The motherfucking onion, and Mandy already went to get me the, um, what's it you say? Limon. This is how it looks like. Simple, simple bitch. And it goes so good with the mojarritas. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, bitch. I am. There's like so many shit going on right now. I got the fucking, it's the, the fish frying, the chicken frying. It's a fucking mess. 
but it smells like fucking home, bitch. It smells like somebody's cooking and shit. Wow, Sophia. Just add a little salt. Yep. Your fish burnt like mine. Just put your fish for like three minutes, three minutes, four minutes. I don't know, something like that. And I got my um chicken wings going. I got my rice ready. I got two more left. I got my salad. What else? What else? What else? I still need to make my steak with spinach, bitch. I'm a dirty little bitch. This one for my este, my fish and this one for my pollo. Uh, I hate it when it looks like that. I like it to look like como que me lambió una pinche vaca, wey. Mm. Ooh, ooh. Uh, uh, uh. See that? Ooh, 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 that's how we dress it up up in this hole. We got the lechuga, we got the fishies making love or sleeping next to each other. We got the motherfucking rice. Ooh, 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 bitch, what the fuck is up? What's your name? Okay, so on to the cheese that I wanted to say. So I'm getting my wings for Randy ready. So the other day, I saw somebody from the past. So when I was 16, I had this gay friend. I've always attracted gay males and they attract me because i feel like i could like confide in them i don't know there's something about me and gay men and just like i bond with them so anyway um in high school i had a, like my two best friends were gay so anyways when when i was younger where's the fucking fork when i was younger there was this guy and he was so fucking gay like so gay like he was extra as fuck he had a rollerblades and he would like rollerblade in little shorts and one time we were talking and this guy passed by and he's like man i love sucking his dick he has a beautiful dick and i was like what are you talking about like he's married and he's like no instead he lets me suck his dick and i suck his dick until my lips get purple and i was like bitch what so then um we were talking he was telling me about a time where him and his friend had a kickback or were kicking it and um there was a girl there so they were out drinking and smoking so then his friend started you know the girl humping the girl or having sex with the girl so when they were in the room his friend was on top of the girl and the girl was in the bottom he was in the you know and um my gay friend jumped behind them and they had like a whole thing like a you know like a threesome but the the other guy didn't stop it. Nobody fucking stopped it. Like, they just kept going. And I was like, no way. That didn't happen. And he's like, why do I have to lie? And I was like, okay, I believe you. So anyways, the other day, I was at Walmart. And I saw him. And I was on my Snapchat because I was making a video or something. And I saw him. And he had a whole, had a whole family. Like, he saw me too. Like, I was like... And he looked at me like... But he looked away. Like, I don't know you, but I know you. But, like, we knew each other. Like, we knew what the fuck was happening. And I was shook. Like, this is the most gayest guy I know in my life. Like, his stories are crazy. Like, I know even more stories about him. And it's like, how? Why? You know? And I'm like, oh, I wonder. Like, I don't think somebody that has done so much stuff with men or is attracted to men. Can, why, why marry a girl? I don't know. I just feel bad because, like, I wish he was just happy with a guy, bro. Like, I don't, I don't know whatever happened for him to feel pressured to be with a girl. Like, it's not even worth it. I don't know. What do you guys think? I just, I know there's a lot of men out there like that. My, my best friend growing up, he was gay. And this, he swore up and down that he was not gay until um, he turned, like, fucking 20 or something. And then I caught him in a car. Like, he was, like, kissing a guy. And, and I felt bad because I was like, That's, you're my best Friend. like we would have sleepovers like who has a sleepover with another a boy and a girl unless he's gay you know what i'm saying or unless you're fucking <laughs> finishing up to cook mine here's sofia's steak the butter she likes it like that aquí está la wing de la mandy i still need to do some spinach but we're almost done up in this house hey motherfuckers so here's my plate and the train is gonna pass by you guys are gonna hear it you know what i'll close the door because since there was a lot of cooking going on, there was like smoking shit. So, just add salt. I like to add the patilla on mine, but you could eat it with a salsa. Could you eat it with whatever the fuck you want? 
Pero yo le pongo un poquito tapatía, no tampoco mucho. And I just use my fingers. Because I don't use a fork when it comes to this. Mm. I like to put like a little lettuce. This takes me back to my childhood. Mm. I'm telling you, my mom would always cook this. Mojarreta. Me and my cousins, when we used to go to Mexico, there's like a rio, right? Like a river. And they would all go with the little fish nets. It wasn't like the ones that you buy at Walmart. It was like homemade ones. And um, like a like a bucket, but it had holes in it. I don't know, like a net. And they would catch a bunch of mojarras. But in Mexico, they're not this big. A mojarras are little. Like this. And um, they would catch them. We would come home. And there was like a big tina, like this big thing with water. And we'd throw them in there. And when they got ready to eat, like right before, they would like clean them the way I did. And we would eat and enjoy that motherfucker. And that's why I love to eat this way, bitch. Um, it's kind of dangerous because it has espinas. That's why I eat with my hands and not with a fork. Quick with your fingers. You could feel what the fuck is going on. But anyways, motherfuckers, I hope you guys try this recipe. I hope I gave you a motherfucking idea. To all my bird gang, 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 motherfuckers, I love you. Peace and motherfucking love, bitch. And one more thing. To the fucking puta sucia perra desgraciada hija tu puta madre talking shit. Like, oh, bitch, you don't even make money making these stupid videos. Look, bitch, I've been seeing you talking shit. You leave, bitch, and then you miss me. You miss all of this, and then you come back home. So, obviously, you like something about me, bitch. Porque, you know, if you did, you would shut the fuck up. And you know what? I may not be this big-ass motherfucking YouTuber and shit. And... But there's one thing about me. I do this because I love that shit. And even if I don't make fucking money, I love to fucking cook. I like to see my kids eat. So suck a fucking dick or maybe choke on it, bitch. Porque you don't know what? You don't know what I'm doing here. I'm living, bitch. So anyways, that's it. Bye.